What up, YouTube? Welcome back to Nino Kuni 2 Revenant Kingdom. Um, now we are on our way back to Neil's forest. So, uh, I wonder. Yes, please. I've been wondering about this for a while, how to do it and everything. Oh, okay, nice. Nice. Okay. Saved so much time. Hey. You're back, eh? How do you go with Odd Poggy? Hmm. Um, well, we didn't quite manage to get your forest back yet. But we did find out the game is rigged all the way to the top. Jinx. I knew it. The crafty wee roasters. Now all we need to do is get some proof that there's funny business afoot with Lady Luck as well. You haven't noticed people from Gopal doing anything strange in the woods lately, have you? Well, they were up to something over there in the Owl Woods there. But to be honest, there were so many of the beggars trapping in, trespassing in and out. I couldn't keep track of all of it, of it all. Maybe that's where they're making the dice. Let's go and have a look, shall we? Bless. Yo, hold your horses, laddie. Ye not be going anywhere near the other woods unless you can cast a quicken growth. What's that? To spell ye great bambolt bampot. Oh no, we've never you've never heard of it. Arch kids these days. Here, I'll teach it to ye. I'm like, whoa, what was that? You just did that mentally, telepathically? It's like, and what kind of spell is it exactly? Can you not figure it out from the name? It makes plants grow fast. Cast on wee beauty on a tiny on a teeny tiny seed, and there will be a tree as tall as a house before you can bleak. The path to the plane ties to get there down that way. If you sling the spell at a few toadstools, you'll find the growing a bit easier. Thanks for the tip, Tigway. Thank you. Thank you so much now rightio let's go looks like we're off to the out woods i wouldn't sound so pleased about it if i were you the monsters over that way could have over that way been the right pain in the neck lately all right it's been a while since we fought i don't even think we fought in the last episode like we did absolutely nothing. So uh There you go, your fight sequence right there. I mean quit playing. I'll find a I'll find a um an actual fight. Nice. Okay. Five hundred. Oh yes. I feel rich. Another 500? Oh. A bow. And mushrooms. Um, can't fall. Why can't we fall? Wait, so where are we? Okay. So we have to go over here. Wait, I think I know where we're supposed to go. It's like somewhere near like the beginning of this place. Like it was some kind of Ah. 
like so. Ah, come here, man. It's over. Ah, I missed it. What else we have here? Um, how we get across? Nope, it's not what I wanted. Okay, so where are we? Nope, back. All right. Um, I'm guessing up here. We'll take care of these guys real quick. Oh no, I'm confused. <gasps> what? Ah, man, Tani. Okay, um, items. Okay. Oh, hey, what's in here? Nice. Okay, two pots. Exactly what I needed. Cause I'm running low on health. I didn't even realize. Can I climb up here? Gosh. Nice. All right. Um. Like these are eviction notices. <laughs> that is amazing. Mad big. Like get the heck out. Um it's not where we're supposed to go. Okay. Yeah, I need to learn to um, keep an eye out for the Higgles so they know. Just like that, so they can help me. Oh snap! Do y'all think? Let me uh heal up. I stay having to heal this girl. Her defense isn't really all that high. Need to buy something that will increase her defense. Some more clothes or something. Um, ah, here we go. It's like, how do I get up there? Uh, so pretty, so beautiful. I'm 
this whole game is beautiful. I wonder if the last game was like this. I don't know. Maybe I'll play it one day. If I have like nothing else to play. But this year and next year. Yo. For games like everything seems to be coming out. Like this year we got Spider-Man and Rise of the Tomb Raider. Or I mean not Rise. Shadow of the Tomb Raider. So um. Ofram Sword. Not stick. All right, yeah. Watch this. No, get out of here. Yeah, she's a long range fighter. Alright, that's good to know. Cause now I know how to use her, kind of. Yo, does Evan even get hit? Does he even get damage? <laughs> Did I just buff that man up so much that he doesn't Oh, what's this? That he doesn't take damage. Wow. Wow. They've been busy. Mm. So this is where they're making the tricky dice. How shall we do this? Charge in shouting our heads off? No. No. We can't draw attention to ourselves. We need to slip in undetected and find out what they're doing. Disguises. Hide yourselves. Some swabs are coming. <sighs> Why did they have to build it so far away? Huh. Fool. Any closer than the people of the city would surely discover it. They're from Goldpaw. They must be. <laughs> Obviously. Alright, I have a mighty fine idea of all, all of a sudden. You know, I think I might be thinking what you're thinking. Huh? Mm. Good job. And the perfect size, apparently. I guess I should have expected as much from a pair of Sky Pirates. Are you sure this will work? Only one way to find out that. We'll keep watch out here. Off you go and sneak into the, that there dice factory. Just don't be too long, alright? Guess we don't have much choice. Come on. Here we go, y'all. Here we go. I mean, I feel like they should have been caught like right now since they don't look like dogs <laughs> at all. It's like, hey, you guys don't look like a dog. What are you doing? Um, phew, I was sure he was going to see through our disguises. Well, he didn't. Looks like this might just work. Even though it shouldn't. Right. Um, alright, we need at least two forms of proof. The first is something tying Pugnacious directly to the deception. Some kind of documentary of evidence would be ideal. 
the next is evidence of how they're manipulating the dice. My guess is they're not using magic. Oh. Really? But how else could it be done? <laughs> oh, there are ways. We have a few different techniques for manipulating things from a distance where I'm from. I wouldn't be surprised if somebody here has come up with something similar. Alright, All right, let's find that proof. Let's do it. These disguises should help us get closer to the people who work here. Maybe we can pick up some clues. Alright, uh, let's go clue hunting. Into the... Sorry, excuse me. Um, you got something to say, huh? Oh, you look fishy. I guess I was wrong. I guess it's not a dog only, uh, factory or workplace. Hmm? This? Oh, this is a personal suggestion. A few improvements of our basic dice design. Yeah. We cannot go on making the same old thing forever. After all, we should be seeking out new ideas all the while. What you have to say? Hey there. You there? Have you seen my blueprints? Do you not even know what blueprints are? Ah, forgive me. I should have taken better care of them. There, all the dice meet the required standard, and that is this week's quota met. So now it is time to relax. Arf. Yes. Gopal has been famous for his tricks and contraptions, you know. It is our job to make all the knowledge and use it to create even more exciting dice. And only we high officials of the realm are permitted the privilege of working with them. Such an honor, such a great honor. Yeah. Keep thinking that's like a lady, but it doesn't sound like one. You must excuse me, I am rather busy at the moment. You must assemble all the necessary documents in order to proceed the factory, process the factory accounts. Sometimes I regret choosing to work in the accounting department, constantly hounded by everybody and never a word of thanks. Alright, so we have to find documents or uh, pieces of something to get to the documents. Huh? Hmm. Where are the spare control units? I'm sure I left it here on the table. I'm sick to the back teeth of turning out regular dice day after day. When will I finally be allowed to work in the trick dice department? Hey there. How many dice have you made today, friend? I'm feeling especially productive. I feel I may even break my daily record. Will you now? Yeah. My superior told me recently that despite appearances to the contrary, these devices are not actually powered by magic. He says that in fact they rely on technology that we import from another country kingdom. I am not sure I believe him. It looks just like magic to me. How dare, how dare you? I am not idling. I, I, I have something very important to do. And what about you, hmm? Should you not be getting back to work also? Shut up, don't you judge me. Oh. Roland, look. This must be it. And based on all this stuff, it looks like what I thought. A remote control for the Lux dice. It's just... It's just like you said. <laughs> A lucky <laughs> guess. Anyhow, Pugnacious must have one of these. So this is how he keeps the taxes so high. And how he stole Nail's forest from him. It sure seems that way. And it's also how we're going to make him pay. We could really use some proof connecting Pugnacious to this place. All right, let's look around a little more. All right, that was in that other room, which I didn't investigate thoroughly. So I'll go back there and look for another table like this. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. You must excuse me. I'm rather busy at the moment. I must assemble all the necessary documents in order to. Okay. Okay. I wasn't talking to you. Let's 
a huge pile of trick dice for use in the casino. They don't seem to have anything to do with Leyluk's die though. What? Haha! -ha. Sign instructions. Look at this. It was in the drawer. That's Pugnacious' signature at the bottom. How you know how his signature looks like? It looks like instructions on what he wants them to build. I'm guessing these were supposed to be destroyed. Lucky, luckily for us, somebody didn't do their job. Well, there's that certainly undeniable proof. Wonderful. That's everything we need. Come on, let's get out of here. Um, I'm gonna switch back to. Actually, I can't do that now. I don't know why I did it before, but I should switch back to Evan, but. Unauthorized intruders detected initiating attack sequence. <laughs> oh my goodness! Tony, Batu, the heck is that? Blimey. Sorry, looks like we got rumbled. What's this horrible thing doing here anyway? I don't like our chances, girly. They're trapped. Come on. Then we have to help them. Mossy Monument. All right. Let's see what you got, man. Here goes nothing. Nice. Okay. Come here, guys. Oh, snap. I have no magic, none at all. Oh, snap. That man messed me up. But we are doing some damage on him. Oh, snap. I really wanted to try that magic out. But it takes so long to charge. Nice. Alright, let's do the scoring for the kill. Oh my goodness. Yo, these little ones. They be doing so much damage. It's like ridiculous. It's not even fair. What am I supposed to do with that? Alright, everybody leveled up. So that's good. Phew. I thought me goose was cooked there for a second. Looks like the people in the factory didn't notice the racket earlier. We got lucky there. How? Well, did you find the precious proof? Yes, we found the device Pugnacious uses to control the dice's movement. Alright, that's the stuff, lad. Now we can hag the swiggling dog out to dry. We sure can. With this thing to help us, we'll be able to expose him for the fraud he is. Evan, I need you to be sure you're okay with what, you're, what we're about to do. We'll be interfering directly in another country's affairs. If it doesn't go well for us, things could get ugly. And if they go really badly, you could be making an enemy of an entire nation. Are you willing to take that risk? Stealing from one's own people is unforgivable. We cannot stand by and let, it th let that happen. We have to give the citizens of Gopal their country back. 
Yeah, what Lofty said. Yeah. Yeah, I knew you wouldn't let him walk all over them. You grow more kingly by the day, your majesty. Uh -huh. You really are starting to sound like a king, you know that? All right, Ali has set out his policy. And now it's time to implement it. All right. Um, with that done, I will see you guys. <gasps> Treasure. Ooh, what is this? Elite Sorceress Ring. Sounds fancy. I like it. Um, any more treasures? I want. What's this? Oh, is that a Higgle thing? Yes. I want another Higgle. Give me. Give me a wart, Higgle. A voice can be heard coming from the Higgle Stone. Well met, Traveler. Show me what you got. Give me what I like, and I will like you quite a lot. Uh Okay, the gunk mushrooms. <laughs> I was like, ah, there's so many mushrooms, which one? Nice. Oh yes. But I don't see it. Is it is it really part of my team? Three out of three, three out of four, four out of four. Um I feel like since these two are like the same. Will occasionally create more Higgles when attacked with their own element. Let's see, slightly decreases the enemy's physical attacks. Okay. Switch you out for you. War spray cannon. Okay. So we can only have like three different, I mean, four Higgles at, the, at a time. Like, I can't have. It said I can have 10. I don't know. I need to find out how to increase these. Alright. Um. Yeah, as I was about to say, I'll see you at Gopal. Peace. Well, okay. Here we go, guys. Welcome back. That didn't take long, did it? Uh, Alright. Now we're going to go up here and show this man that we mean business. Should have taken the offer, man. Should have taken the offer. Might be of uh dang, what is that movie? Chronicles of Riddick. Where uh, Vin Diesel was talking to that mercenary. Should have taken the money tombs. Mm. Ah, you again. And did Lady Luck provide evidence of the dashly machinious of which you imagine us guilty? Master Pugnacious, you have deceived Nail and your own people, the very people you're supposed to serve. Hmm? More wild accusations. And where is your proof, hmm? Did you find evidence of trickery? Some ingenious plan, device 
hidden somewhere inside Lady Luck, perhaps? Come on, you know we're on to you. Why not drop the act? There is no act to drop. I am innocent of the mistress of fortune herself will attest. Will she now? Hmm. That's not such a bad idea. I hear she's the one who passes judgment on legal matters around here. How does a trial sound? Indeed. Hmm. That sounds like a very fine idea indeed. Yes, this is the way of gold, Paul. All matters of state, be they legal, political, or otherwise, are decided by the roll of the sacred dice. And as ruler of this great nation, I am more than willing to submit myself to the judgment of Lady Luck. But know that if I am find, found innocent, I shall treat your attempts at sedation with the, gra with the gravity they deserve. You will be punished for crimes against the state. Do you accept my terms? Mm. We do. Then we will begin the preparations right away. Come to the square at the appointed time. Oh snap, we about to send this man to trial. Alright, time for the main event. I'll leave this to you, if you don't mind, Roland. Sure. Sure, I was hoping you'd say that. Nice. Alright. So we about to face this man and show him for the fraud that he is in the next episode. Why? Because I'm going to end it here. Um, so thank you for joining me in all that. And yeah, next episode, that's it. The conclusion of Gold Paw. We're going to send this man out. We're going to kick him on his butt. And we're going to give Gold Paw back to his country, its citizens. All right. See you and have a good day.